top 5 hacking tools used by hackers. Hey guys, my name is Teja and in this video I'm going to talk about the top 5 hacking tools generally used by hackers. The links to download these applications will be in the description below. So if you want to download these tools, you can check the description out and you can download those tools from the links mentioned in the description below. This video is only for education purposes. I take no responsibility of whatever you do. Without further ado, let's get started. Aircrack NG is pre-installed in Kali Linux. However, you can download it for Windows or for Mac OS from the official website. It is a complete suite of tools to assess Wi-Fi security. It can crack passwords of Wi-Fi networks which are WPA, WPA or WPA2 or WEP encrypted by the method of brute forcing. This uses FMS attack which stands for Flavor Mantin and Shamir attack. It works firstly by capturing a 4-way handshake with the AP, that is the Wi-Fi router. The 4-way handshake is obtained by deauthenticating the devices connected to the target Wi-Fi network using AirPlay NG. And then it can perform a brute force attack using a word list of your choice. In such a way, AirCrack NG cracks WPA, WPA2 and WEP Wi-Fi passwords. Remember that stronger passwords are always harder to crack. For more guidance on how to use Aircrack NG, watch one of my other tutorial. The link to that video will be in the description below. Etocap is available for Windows and Linux. Unfortunately, the Windows version of Etocap is having some issues and it doesn't work fine. Etocap stands for Ethernet Capture. Etocap is the most comprehensive suit for man-in-the-middle attacks. Using Etocap, you can perform a man-in-the-middle attack and hence, you can sniff the passwords and usernames from a victim's PC which is on the same network that you are connected to. This tool features ARP poisoning. Hackers use this technique to sniff your personal info by placing themselves as the man in the middle. If once you are infected by this, then the information that you send over the network is vulnerable. This includes sniffing your online banking details, email credentials and more of your personal data. That is why it is not recommended to connect to a public Wi-Fi because the information that you send over that network can be seen by others. Whiteshock is an open source packet analyzer. It comes with graphical user interface. It is available for Linux, Windows and Mac OS. It comes pre-installed with Kali Linux. Whiteshock captures the network packets and tries to display them in human readable format. It uses various color codes in order to show the information clearly. In simple words, using Whiteshock, you can sniff usernames, passwords and the websites that are visited by a device which is connected to the same network that you are connected to. Which means you can remotely hack a device which is connected to the same network. John the Ripper is available for Linux, Windows and Mac OS. Once again, this software comes pre-installed with Kali Linux. John the Ripper is an offline password cracking tool which is used to crack password hashes. At present, it can crack more than 40 password hash types such as DES, MD5, etc. You just have to mention the password hash of the password which you want to crack and John will crack the password hash for you. However, this is a time-taking process and it completely depends upon the strength of the password.
SQL Map is available for Linux, Windows and Mac. It is pre-installed on Kali Linux. SQL Map is an open source penetrating testing tool used to exploit SQL injections flaws into database servers. It comes with a powerful detection engine. It can be used for database fingerprinting, data fetching from the database. At present, it can hack MySQL, Oracle, PostgreSQL, Microsoft SQL Server, Microsoft Access, IBM DB2, SQLite, Firebird, Sybase, SAP, MaxDB, HSQDB, and Infomix databases. Using this tool, you can fetch a vulnerable website and then hack into its database, which may contain personal data, such as the site, password, and username. If you're watching this on your mobile, click on the bell symbol and you'll be notified every time I upload a new video. Hit the subscribe button for more videos. Like my Facebook page at facebook.com slash techcoach156. Follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash techcoach156. Visit my website at techcoach156.com. Thanks for watching. Cheers.